For ACUsports.com, I'm Grant Boone. We continue our preview of the 2015 ACU football season with that season opener against Fresno State on deck. We've got quarterbacks coach John David Baker, and we've got starting quarterback Parker McKenzie, the last two men to be the quarterback here at ACU. Parker, let's start with you. Last year, 22 touchdowns, nine interceptions, a terrific ratio in your very first season as the starting quarterback. Take me back to that first game against Georgia State. You're going back home uh, where you spent a, a lot of your childhood in the Georgia Dome, a place where there have been Super Bowls played. What was that experience like? And then how did you feel like the year progressed for you? Well, the experience was awesome, no doubt. But uh, just to have that year and the season that I had, I just have to thank my linemen, have to thank my coaches, have to thank all the guys that made plays. I mean, I trusted my train. I just went out there and did it. You wound up uh, in the top 12 in the nation in passing efficiency, which is this compilation of, of a bunch of different statistics. What it really means is, is, is you're throwing it and your teammates are catching it not the other team and you're throwing for a lot of yards that's a statistic as you may know that means a lot to your head coach and we've had some guys like this guy here to your right who've been very high in the nation uh, what numbers do you look at when you say I've had a good game I uh, look at the number of catches my receivers had my running backs had how many completions I had and if I didn't have any sacks that way I can thank my linemen later last year six and six uh, was the overall record for the team four and four in conference play you give me a re report card a as to what you thought of the season and why. I thought we did a great job. We went out there, we progressed each game. We had spectacular games. We had down games. We're going to go out there this season. We're going to try to go win some more. All right, let's talk to uh, your position coach here. J.D., uh, you set the all-time ACU record back in 2013 with 40 total touchdowns, uh, and you got a chance last year uh, to coach up this young fellow. What did you see from him, and what have you seen in spring and now fall camp? Uh, just the biggest thing, he's he's progressed each and every day. Every practice, uh, every meeting, every game, he, he, every day he would just take another step. And and that's the thing that, that has been most impressive is he's he's learned not only to lead himself but lead others. You know, each and every day he's coming out here trying to figure out, you know, how do I make the guy next to me better? How do I how do I figure out to push him and, and, and to push his buttons to get him going in the right direction? That's That's the thing I've seen the most and been most impressed with. Last year, we also had, when Parker couldn't play against Central Arkansas, Cade Munden come in. Uh, I think three of his first six passes went for touchdowns in that first quarter against Central Arkansas. He wound up rushing for more than 100 yards, something you did as an ACU player. Uh, and then we've also seen a little bit of Dallas Seeley here in, in the spring and in the fall. G aside from Parker, tell me a little bit about uh, what you've seen from Dallas Seeley. Dallas, he's done really well. He's made a huge leap from where he was at in the spring to where he's at now. Um, just his retention from the spring and, and how he's kind of figuring things out. You can just kind of see where things are starting to click in his head. Uh, he's doing a really good job. He's protected the ball really well, which is, you know, the biggest thing for us as, as quarterbacks. Uh, and then Kay is a guy that he'll mix in for us. You know, he can do some, some special things with his feet. Um, and that's kind of the deal with all of our quarterbacks. They all kind of bring something different to the table. Um, Parker can sit back there and sling it and make great decisions with his mind. Um, Dallas is kind of a mixture of both. Uh, and then Cade can run it. And so we'll kind of figure out a way to use all three that's you know best for the team that's going to help us win. Ideally, for any football team at any level, you've got really, really good players at the same position who push each other to be better. Is that is that happening here? Oh, definitely. And they're both highly competitive guys. I mean, they do. They push each other uh, in, a, in a very serious way. And, and, and Parker's competitive, Dallas competitive. And so that's what you want, though. You, you don't want – somebody that feels like they can come out every day and just kind of coast through practice and that's not how it is for these guys and you know I think that's the best way it, it should be. You went through it with coach Collins as a player and now you're one of his um, one of his men teaching these guys now why is Ken Collins a good quarterbacks coach? Um, because he demands the absolute best out of you and there's no exception there's no you know well I'll, I'll take it easy on no it's the hammers down each and every day and there's no there's no slacking. You better come out every day like there's 50,000 people in front of you and you're playing a game or else you're going to get beat. And that's that's the way that we approach it every day. That's the way that we make our guys approach it. And that's why, you know, we've had eight of the last nine years a guy throw for over 3,000 3, yards because we're efficient. And guys are able to carry over the way that they play in practice to a game. It's When they get to a game, it's easy for them <laughs> because they've seen it and they've been in that pressure. And, and Coach Collins does a really good job of, of kind of creating that pressure. He he makes you feel squeezed, and so when you get in the game, it's it's like nothing. You've been there before. 
Well, there will be 50,000 fans at Bulldog Stadium in Fresno, California next Thursday night when ACU opens its 2015 campaign against those Fresno State University Bulldogs. And Parker McKenzie will be under center starting the game out for ACU. For Parker and for quarterbacks coach John David Baker, I'm Grant Boone for ACUsports.com.